Okay, now we're back. And we're going to get straight into this level. That one's a pretty easy toad to find. They do get a lot harder later on. And I mean a lot harder. Sometimes you just you end up going through the level about two or three times before you can find them. Because it's n not always obvious where they are. There we go. That's the explanation of um, how you can restore vibe energy. I told you Perry absorbs it. <laughs> and after this level, um, if I get enough coins, I will show you the shop. Ugh. And here we go again with the vines. Hopefully I can do a better job than last time, although it doesn't look like it. Stupid keyboard. Ah! No! <laughs> ah, right, yeah. Okay, try this again. Actually, no. Good idea to keep your vibe meter as full as you can get it. That way, if you encounter something that you need the vibe meter for, then you're obviously ready. And there's a puzzle piece. Now these blue rings are like normal donut rings, but they uh, they fall a lot quicker, and they fall as soon as you touch them. Drop down here, and there's the second toad. have the pound umbrella yet so and there's a third toad I'm trying to scoop the box up and take it with me but no What's up with the pink grass? Seriously. And you know, it's not just pink grass, it's blue grass now. I'm like, why? 
Just because it's a girly game, it's got to be nice and bright. I mean, come on, at least stay realistic, for crying out loud. You can actually just go press down and slide. Right. Damn it. Needed at least 20. Oy. Okay, we'll delay our... Uh... Oh, damn it. We'll delay our uh, explain, uh, showing of the shop then.